okay, hello guys so this is the samsung galaxy phone and in this video i'll show you how to flash stock rom without using computer okay you heard it right i will test it on the samsung galaxy a04e and it should work on any samsung android phone okay so for doing this you don't need the computer you only need another phone that has been rooted okay? and you also need an app that called tor you can see right here this is the progress that i have uh done before okay i will show you the process before and after all you need to do is prepare for the usb cable okay all the file and step i will provide in my blog you can check the link in the description box okay so if you have have a problem your phone is boot loop or simply you just want to flash latest firmware or going back to the stock room after being rooted and you don't have computer you can use this method okay okay so stay tuned and check it out <laughs> Okay, hello, assalamualaikum guys, we meet again with Ombop and now in front of me I have a two pawn. this is the Xiaomi Pawn Redmi Note 9 Pro and this is the Galaxy A04e Okay, so in this video I will show you how to flash <coughs> stock ROM for Samsung Pawn without using a computer Okay <coughs> As you know, to flash the stock ROM for Samsung phone, usually we need a software called Odin, and Odin only run on Windows on computer. Okay, so if you don't have a computer, usually you cannot flash it, and <clears throat> usually some of you guys need to flash your Samsung phone because your phone has been brick or you need to upgrade to the latest software or maybe you just want to go to the stock firmware after routing or flashing custom on your phone okay so in this video i will give you a solution how to do it without computer okay <clears throat> so the first thing you need to do is a pawn that has been rooted okay, so this xiaomi pawn I already read it using images. You can see right here. And second one, we need software called Tor. It is APK and need root access. And next, of course, we need the cable. Depend on your connector for the pawn. Both of the pawn use the Type C, so we're going to use the Type C to Type C. And for the next step, of course, you need the stock chrome okay stock firmware for this one okay you can check the code name go to the settings about pawn and you can see right here the code name is a042f okay so you can find the firmware using this code a042f <coughs> okay let's find from here Usually, uh, I'm, uh, I go to the samfirmware.com to find the software. You just tap A0, uh, where is it, or 2 uh, sorry, A042F, it is 1, <clears throat> and scroll down, okay, from here, you can find your region just scroll to the right <coughs> and because I'm Indonesian I'm select the Indonesian region and from here you will find lots of uh, stock firmware and after you finish download the file you can open it using the Z archiver you can download this app from Play Store just open it and open the Z file view and inside the zip file you can find the ap bl cp and csc extract to a folder and i already extract in here okay so 
you will get the four file and from there open the tour and usually for the first time it will ask for root access okay let's open it okay just grant it <clears throat> and from here you can hit the button and select the file okay hit the bl button right here select the bl ap select the ap cp select also the file and also the csc okay after it finish load all the file you need to plug the usb cable between the between the two pawn okay so from here you need to turn off the pawn power it off and after the pawn has been turned off you must press the volume up volume down at the same time and then plug the cv cable until you see the download screen okay let's try it now after you successfully uh, put it into here you need to press the follow up once okay now you are in the download mode okay and after you successfully put it into the download mode okay make sure that it's already connected in in here okay cannot remove this cable because my cable is broken you can see right here connected device status ready okay and if you fail to see the connected device you should try to change your usb cable or you have a bad usb cable okay now we can see the progress right here console start processing flashing the all the file that needed the recovery uh super and other stuff yeah you can see right here i cannot uh, let's try to zoom cannot zoom from it i hope you can see it you can zoom from the youtube and you can see there is a progress right here okay it will take time so <clears throat> i will skip this video and now you can see the process is almost done 100 percent and the pawn will automatically reboot okay just for information uh the samsung pawn has not been unlocked the bootloader and also has not been root okay finish and it will automatically boot it into the sock recovery and format the data okay <clears throat> and we can also see in here the progress okay flashing the super user data and other stuff okay nice let's wait until it finished and boot it into the home screen oh, we already finished now we are in the home screen now let's go to the settings about pawn okay a04e with the codename is a042f system information and you can see right here now we are using the binary 6 okay same as the firmware that we have downloaded before in from the Xiaomi Pawn. Okay, that's all guys. I hope it helps you. All the file and video I will provide in my blog. You can check the link in the description box. Okay. And if you have any question, feel free to ask in the comment section. I will try to answer it. Okay. So see you in the next video. Wassalamualaikum.